Hello guys, welcome to the YouTube channel. So in this video we are just talking about the how to fix the last pass Safari extension which is not working. So without any delay, let's begin the video. So why this uh, Safari extension is not working in the last pass? So basically there are some uh, reasons behind it. So first reason will be the, the extension might not work in Safari because of a recent upgrade of the web browser version or incompatibility. The second one, system maintenance application, antivirus tools, security suit may prevent last pass from being seen or working properly. The third one, maybe your version of macOS is not supporting Safari because this app extension is supported in two most recent major macOS versions with the 64-bit processor required. The fourth one, if you are using an outdated version of a last pass, then you may face this problem. The fifth, it may it might be due to the extension not being enabled or password manager extension deactivation. So by these reasons, this issue is being occurring. So how can we fix this issue immediately? So there are some uh, uh, initial measures. So first uh, initiative is ensure that your macOS version is supported and compatible with the last pass. So in this, you should check whether the Safari app extension is supported on the two most recent major macOS version with the 64-bit processor Lee in necessary requiredly. So to install the latest version of LastPass, you should follow this step. Step number one, firstly you should exit Safari. Second, choose the LastPass menu bar icon and then select check for updates. The third one, you should choose the install update. Okay. And the fourth, relaunch the LastPass Safari app extension. You can also update the LastPass to its new version directly if it's available in the web store. So second initiative will be the check if LastPass is hidden. So in this, it may be possible that a web browser icon is hidden if you have upgraded LastPass and confirm that it is enabled. So you can follow these steps to unhide it. Firstly, go to view, click on the customize toolbar. The third, you should drag the icon of LastPass and drop it in the toolbar. Okay. So these steps, uh, you, you can unhide it. Okay. The third initiative will be the re-enable the LastPass extension. So if it is not working and you are encountering this issue, then follow this step to re-enable the extension. Firstly, you should exit the Safari. Second, relaunch Safari. Then again, click on the menu bar, tap on Safari and then on settings. The fourth step will be the click on the extensions tab. The fifth, you should uncheck the box for the last pass option in the left navigation. The sixth, Check the box for the last pass option to re-enable re it. Okay. So fourth one is uninstall and reinstall the last pass for Safari app extension. So to get rid of the bugs and glitches, you can uninstall and reinstall the application. So you should follow this step. Firstly, if you have to uninstall the last pass, then you should quit Safari. Then execute the last pass for Safari app extension app. Now go to the application folder, click on the last pass Safari app extension app and drag it into the trash. In this way, you can uninstall the last pass extension. Now reinstall it by following these steps. Firstly, download the last pass Mac app, which includes the last pass for Safari app extension. Second, open the application folder and then open the LastPass app. After opening the application, fill your login credential to enter in your app. 
Now select open Safari to enable the LastPass for Safari extension. The fifth one will be the add LastPass extension to login items. So login items are essentially the startup apps on Windows. Okay. These apps will run. This app will run in the background when you are boot your PC. Follow these steps. So, firstly, click on the Apple logo on the top left corner. Go to the System Preferences. Then select the Users and Groups option. After selecting User and Group option, you should switch to the Login Items. Now, click on the plus icon. After clicking on the plus icon, you should select the last pass and click on Add. Okay. So this can resolve any startup issues faced by the LastPass extension in macOS. So sixth one is if any of the above mentioned points is being not resolved this issue, then you should may contact the LastPass support team for the same issues. They can just help you and resolve this issue very efficiently. So the video is comes to be end. So in this video, we are just talking about the LastPass Safari extension, which is not working and what are the causes and what are the reasons behind it, why it is not working and how can we just resolve this issue very efficiently and prominent manner. So if you like this video, just click on a like button and do subscribe the channel and don't forget to uh, click on the bell icon for further updates. So thank you so much for watching this video